Some families in Bradley County are also seeing issues at home. One in Cleveland shows the flooding in their backyard that goes knee deep. The family says they have seen it this bad before and they're looking to the city to improve the drainage system on that street before water gets into their home. Isaiah Kim Martinez is in studio now to share their story. Isaiah. Yeah, Josh Latricia, the Blackwell family and their three kids, soon to be four, bought this home or the home on this property more than two years ago with the intent of using their backyard often. Not only is that out of the question most of the time, now they're worried about the stability of their home. Many consider the sound of rain to be peaceful, but every time the Blackwell family hears it here in Cleveland, it's the sign of bad things to come. By one o'clock, we had water all the way up to the, on the side of the house and like up towards the road. Here you can see the Blackwell's entire backyard on Northwest Harpo Street flooded after this week's constant rain. It's just, it's a, it's a battle dealing with it. And just for you to get a sense of how deep this water can actually get, this is just on the edge of where it starts next to this home. And if I were to step in like this right on the edge, I'm already pretty much my shoes are inside and they're pretty much covered by the water. That's just here. If I were to go even farther down towards the middle, homeowners say it could get all the way up to knee deep. Water gets into our heat and air unit. Um, we have sometimes water gets under the house. Yesterday water got into the storage building that's sitting on blocks. Tressa Blackwell says the city pipes on this street never drain properly and their kids can rarely ever play in the backyard. Blackwell tells me she's called in city engineers who according to her say that because the home is private property if they want it fixed it's their responsibility. But she says her property is the end result not the cause. Somebody needs to do something. I, that's what I feel like because it's not our property. It's not our drain. It just backs up into our yard. Out to Public Works in Cleveland and city engineers. We're expecting to hear a call back within the hour with their explanation. We'll have those details coming up at six guys. Isaiah, thank you. The Cleveland family tells us they believe their yard is dry fewer than two months out of the entire year. Remember, you